Hi, today I have some exciting news because um, I've just heard that one of my favourite new Myel makeup products is about to hit the warehouse and will soon be available for us all to order. So this product is the gorgeous Cheeky Blush. Um, and I think this is going to be a really nice product for you to demonstrate, to use yourselves and I'm really hoping for great sales with this lovely little compact. So one of the things I get asked a lot is how to use a blusher alongside the strobing and contouring kit. So I'm just going to take a couple of minutes today to show how I use the two products together and hopefully make it very, very easy for you to see how to use it and how to use with your customers. So I'm going to start off using the Define shade um, because I've got quite a warm skin tone and this shade works really well for me. I'm using it with the retractable contouring brush. So I'm just loading my brush, not too much. Tap the excess off there. And to draw my contour on to start off with, I like to push the brush up so I've got a nice firm tip on the brush there. And I'm just going to pop it basically from the top of my ear down the hollow of my cheek, pretty much as you can see in line with the edge of my eye there. So I'm literally just drawing in that line. Hopefully you can see, put a little bit more on. So literally to that point there. And then I'm just going to buff that out to make it nice and soft. Okay, so you can hopefully see that line of contour now, just in that area there. Do the other side. So just load up my brush, tap the excess off, and bring that into that area again. Okay, so there's nice soft definition just underneath the cheekbone. I'm now going to use some of the highlight shade just to soften that contour a little bit and blend it out. So literally just going over that area again. And then to finish off with this particular kit, I'm going to use some of the illuminating shade. Now I'm using the eyeshadow blending brush for this because I like the fact that it's a little bit of a smaller head for doing finer, more detailed work. So I'm going to pop a little on my chin, just down the center of my face. Little pop in the corners of the eyes there. And just a tiny bit there on the lip. And now I'm going to blend that all in. When you've got a slightly older skin like mine, um, this highlight just gives that nice kind of illuminated look to the skin and just brightens everywhere. So just adds that little bit of an extra dimension. Now, for the blush, I'm going to use the angled cheek brush from the Essential Brush Kit because this has got a really nice contour and I'm going to mix all four shades together. So swirling the brush around there. I like to pop a little bit more of the coral because I've got a little bit more of a warmer skin tone. Tap the excess off. And now I'm going to apply this pretty much from the center of my eye, just along the top of the cheekbones there. So sweeping back towards the hairline. So you can kind of get the idea because it's going from the top of the apples of the cheeks and into that area there. A bit more. And just blend it through. So I think you can hopefully see the difference. Lighting makes such a lot of difference here. 
and that just gives that kind of cheek you've got the contour that's really giving it that warmth that nice flush of color without looking um too dolly cheeked and too kind of that, too much of a pop of color on the apples of the cheeks it's really nice and soft going along the top of the cheekbone there so nice white dusting and blending in And this brush is great for that because it just really does sit on the lovely contour there um, on the top of the cheekbone and it just feels lovely. You don't get too much product on there. It's just lovely. Um, to finish off, I am actually going to go back to the strobing and contouring kit because I just want an extra little bit of highlight on the tops of my cheekbones. So here, I'm just going to lift that there, just right on the top so you can just see a little bit extra shimmer. And it's just a really nice, soft, illuminated finish. Very natural, not overly made up, but just gives that lovely lift. It pulls your features up. As you get older, your skin loses pigmentation and you need that extra little bit of pop of colour. I know lots of women are so used to just using a bronzer, but when you have your blush, it just gives that lovely natural flush of colour and really does make all the difference. So um, look forward to seeing this hit the website soon and I'd love to know your thoughts when you get hold of it.